where Si and Anne, otherwise known as Slaw and Mrs Slaw. In this series, we're driving the wild Atlantic way around the west coast of Ireland in our motorhome. We visit stunning beaches where the dogs love to have a run around. We drive through magnificent scenery at every corner. In this episode, we take a boat trip to view the famous Sleagleave Cliffs and we love a drop of the black stuff. So come along with us and enjoy our adventures. morning. It's beautiful. We're so lucky with this weather. Uh, today is day four. Uh, we've just left Malinbeg and uh, we've got uh, a boat trip planned this morning. My colour coordinated folder. We're going to uh, Teeling Pier to get one of the boat trips around um, the cliffs that's Lee Lee. I hope the sea's not rough. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit windy. So come along with us and enjoy our adventures today. Let's go. People in that car were watching us on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, that was very strange. Went to ask them to just pull up a bit so we could get motorhome in, and uh, he smiled at me out the window, showed me his phone, and they're watching us on YouTube because they'd seen the sticker on the back of Helga. <laughs> no idea what Mrs. Slow's booked is here. Boat trip. I need my swimming attire. You can swim off the boat if you want. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, people I'll, do. I'll video you. Can't see any seats on that. Looking at that happen. I'll get stuck on that. <laughs> We're going. I hope you haven't been drinking. The highest point, 600 metres high. And we've got a bit of a swell on the boat. <laughs> Can you tell? <laughs> Three times the height of the cliffs of Moa. <laughs> We're rocking. We are rocking. This boat is rocking. Don't come knocking. Don't know whether you could pick it up or not. Right at the top there is the viewing point. You can just see some people. 
Viewing point. But we went to the highest point. Highest point. It's not only him can take photos, you know. Sleeve League are among the highest sea cliffs in Europe. They're nearly three times the height of the Cliffs of Mohair. It's believed that Sleeve League was a place for pilgrimage before the arrival of Christianity to Ireland. If you walk Pilgrim's Path it will take you to the summit of the cliffs at 609 metres high. That's a 1,998 foot drop. Dinner time. Um. <laughs> Dinner time. Then we're on the road. Come on then, let's eat. I didn't know we were going to start filming, so I had a bite of sandwich. And I'm going to have a bite of sandwich. Ham and cheese with brown sauce. We're just looking on the maps. Um, we're going to head off now from Sleeve League over through Killybegs and Donegal. We've got a Grand Prix to watch that I didn't factor into the timings for this driving holiday. So, I don't know where we're going to park up and watch the Grand Prix. We'll find somewhere. Mm. Mm. Stop for Grand Prix. This is Slaw's gonna make coffee, cake. Me and Jesse are watching Grand Prix, are we? Yeah. And it's wet. Oh, 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 oh. Monaco in the wet, baby.
On a clear day, you can see Sleeve League cliffs across Donegal Bay and also the lighthouse at St John's Point. Oh, there we go. Quarter past seven. It's been a long day. We've um, had a really lovely relaxed morning and then it's been um, Sport Sunday, hasn't it? We've had the F1 to watch and then um, Huddersfield Town in the playoffs, which we're not going to mention. We're not even going to go there. Um, we need to, <laughs> we need services for Helga tonight. So we've just booked into Ross's Point Caravan Park um, right on Ross's point. So when Slaw turns the camera around you can see there's lots of places we could have parked for free um, but we've paid the 30 euros tonight so that we can use all the services and what a view we've got. That's awesome. It's a cracker. It's a cracker. Right, in Slaw's words, it's beer o'clock. It is beer o'clock. Give me the beer. Come on with me beer. Oh, Guinness. There you go. What a lively one, that one. It's all over me. I'll wait for you. you what oh, I'll be here just yet. I'm doing my G&T. Huh. I'm wiping your Guinness all off my hands. You're doing a cheers? Oh, you can't. I can't, I'm out with it yet. You'll just have to wait. <laughs> Epic fail! Oh no. It just fell out the freezer. Um, I think that one's yours. Uh, I don't think it is. I think it is. <laughs> it's only a bit of dog water. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. We have this thing where you, where you can't have a drink. In, f in first place, it's got to be together. Um, yeah, synchronized drinking. Come on! Jeepers. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, lovely. Oh. Right. What do you say you're doing now? I'm going to do maps. Oh, maps. Maps. We'll show you where we've been on the maps. Let me get them. Maps. Big map, as you know. We're going from Muff all the way around the wild Atlantic coast down to Kinsale. Today, we've gone from Malinbeg and around to Ross's Point, and that was... 102 miles. So that's where we are on day four. If I show you my planning you'll see that we are absolutely bob on. So planning, day one yellow, day two blue, day three pink, day four yellow again. And today we've done two of the signature discovery points, Sleeve League and Mullamore, Mullagmore Head. Um, so that's where we are. So we're, we're still bang on track to complete our drive uh, in the time that we've got. So um, where have we come today? I'm going to show you on here. 
on this map now. I'll show you. Hang on. Billy, stop whinging. Your tea's in the bowl. Eat it. Eat it up. So, on the map, don't forget, we use this book, which is the Wild Atlantic Way Root, Root Atlas, and it is really good. It comes in really handy when somebody's played silly beggars with the Wild Atlantic Way signs and we can't work out where to go. This morning, we left Malinbeg, and we went back up and around and down to Teelin Pier, where we had the boat ride around to Sleeve League for one of the signature discovery points. We then went uh, to Muckross Head, through Killybegs, and we stopped at Mount Charles Pier to watch the Grand Prix. We then drove through Donegal. We didn't get a chance to, to go into Donegal today because it was Sport Sunday. Uh, we came down to Rosnaula Beach and you'll see I've written there, there's a barrier on the car park. Um, no campers allowed in the, the bit that we were in and I have to say I wasn't really impressed with that place at all. We then came through Ballyshannon and through Bundoran, Bundoran and we went and did a loop of Mugmore Head, signature discovery point and then we came down here down past Drumcliff and out to Ross's Point and that is where we are tonight Ross's Point Caravan Park, 30 euros for the night um, but we're going to make use of all the facilities. We're going to empty all the grey waste, refill with all the water in the tank and all the drinking water um, and head off tomorrow. So, we'll see what we get up to this evening. Drinking. <laughs> Absolutely. Only one. Right, are you going to use the shower, did you Yeah, say? I'm going to go have a shower. Because if you watched yesterday's, you'll know that I've already made the tea. I doubled up with a chilli last night, so we've got yesterday's leftover chilli, loosened with a drop of red and rice. And we showered in the van last night, didn't we? So we did, we've showered every day in the van. Ooh, uh, actually. I'll be showering in it tonight, but you're going... Top up. tip. No, top tip. Top, top tip. tip. Top tip. Puppy pad. From when Jessie was a puppy, obviously unused by Jessie, uh, we use one of those for um, a shower mat. When we step out of the shower, we stand on it and then dry it out in the day and then use it again. So, top tip. Leftover chilli in a Tupperware. Boiling the bag rice and a little bit of red just to loosen the chilli with. See, at the minute, it's a bit claggy. This will soon loosen it. Wasted wine. <laughs> there we go, and immediately that's a much, much better consistency. Forward thinking, Mrs. Slaw. Oh, I'm going to do my jobs recycling, rubbish, coffee pots. Slaw gets to do the lose and the drop.
me two toilets. <laughs> Come on, Mr. Slaw. Hang on, are we empty? Yeah, I've emptied her. We shut that. Shut that. I just haven't checked gas. Shut. Gas is off. Lock that then. Lock that. Lovely day. Miserable. Two toilets emptied. Everything else emptied. Ooh. Grey dropped. No. Filling up the water tank and the drinking water inside. And then we'll be on the road. On the road again. I can't tell you a lot about this campsite because I pulled up, had two beers and went to bed. <laughs> and your tea. Oh, my tea, my tea. Oh, three beers, sorry, three. Ish. Right, come on. Good morning. Oh, good morning. We're leaving Ross's Point. Ah, oh, Ross's Point. Uh, wet Ross's Point. Very wet. Yeah, the weather's turned. Uh, the last couple of days have been lovely. Very wet and miserable today. But I'll tell you a little bit about Ross's Point before we go. Uh, we stayed on the campsite there last night. Um, lovely campsite. Done all our services. Uh, but the jewel on the crown for us was um, we had a little knock on the door last night. Uh, and it was uh, Mary and Sean. So, really good Sean. to meet you, Mary and Sean. Thanks ever so much for coming around to say hello. Hope you enjoy your holiday in Scotland. And um, that's it from Ross's Point, really. Hope your new van oh. is uh, a good one. Deathless. Yeah, a good German, good German build. Yeah. So, if you guys like what you've seen, give us a thumbs up. If you want to come with us on more of our adventures uh, around the west coast of Ireland and any others, please subscribe. If you want to be notified of when we upload the new vlogs, don't forget to ring that bell. Catch us on Facebook and Instagram for real-time updates. And if you see us out and about, like Mary and Sean did, you could... Spot the slaws! And you could be in with a chance of winning one of our lovely mugs if you tag us in social media. Tag. So, we're off on the next leg of our adventure slow. Slow's words. Let's go. Let's go, go.